go at it for 35 laps. Feature competition underway at the Cedar Lake Speedway. Racing into turn one, Carson Macedo up top. Donnie Shotsky in the middle of the speedway, three wide for third momentarily. Jacob Allen has it as they race into three and four. Carson Macedo leads lap number one. Macedo and Sean both go to the bottom, entering into the first corner. On the move, James McFadden by David Crowell. Now a peek to the inside of Logan Shewart. J-Mac up to fourth in the Roth Enterprises, number 83. Cars all over the racetrack at the moment. Brad Sweet has risen to the seventh position, now looking for more. Well, trouble cars sideways over in turn number two and gets hit. Craig Kinzer with Riley Goodno making contact. Goodno had no place to go. We are under yellow flag conditions. We'll take a look at the Dirt Vision replay here and see exactly what happened. May have been some contact earlier that sent Craig Kinzer sideways. And again, Riley Goodnow just with no place to go. Hard contact with the number 11K. Macedo gets on the throttle when we come back to green. Donnie Schatz to the top of the racetrack in one and two drives by Carson Macedo. New leader Donnie Schatz down the back straight away. Donnie Schatz leads lap number three. Brad Sweet battling with David Gravel and Jacob Allen. A three car race for the four spot. The big cat looking for his sixth in a row from row number five. Moving forward early on in this one. Sweet to the outside of the speedway over in turn number two. Gets by Jacob Allen. Brad Sweet, tenth to fourth in the first five laps. Brad Sweet. The big cat on the prowl gets by McFadden to take the third spot. Close quarters action at the end of the front straightaway. Sweet to the bottom out of turn number two. He's got a little bit of a run on Carson Macedo. Brad Sweet looking for second into turn three and four. Slide jump. Macedo turns it back underneath him to hang on to second. Sweet back to the bottom in turn number one. Brad Sweet after Carson Macedo and Macedo getting closer to Donnie Schultz. The shots goes to the bottom in turn three. Caution on the speedway. Car slowing on the top side in turn number three. It's the five of Spencer Baston. Great restart by Carson Macedo. Pulls even with shots. Shots gets to the cushion and takes the race lead. Shots maintains the lead. Jacob Allen up to second out of nowhere. Jacob Allen second now and challenging for the lead down low in turn number four. Donnie Shots now with the short racing 1A right behind him. Shots on the cushion, Jacob Allen down to the bottom of the speedway. Brad Sweet in third, Carson Macedo falls to fourth and now looking for the lead, Jacob Allen out of turn number four. He's right there with Donnie Shots. Shots rides the cushion, Jacob Allen pulls ahead as they enter turn three. Racing for the lead side by side out of turn number four and Jacob Allen has it on lap number 22. Slower car of Allen Gilbertson right in front of that duo. Shots now, trap, sweet moves to the inside in three and four, looking for the second spot, and he's got it, Brad Sweet, second shot, trouble right in front of them. Marcus Dumsney sideways. This one's not over yet. But there's still drama remaining. Great restart by Jacob Allen. Sheldon Hodgson to the top in one and two, coming after Brad Sweet and Donnie Schatz. Allen pulling away, Hodgson to the outside, looking for third. Brad Sweet stalking shots to the inside of Sweet, looking for second. Sheldon Hodgson is right there as well. Sweet shots at Hodgson, second, third, and fourth as Jacob Allen pulls away. One lap to go at Cedar Lake. Jacob Allen trying to hold off Sweet and deny him a sixth straight win, but Sweet rips the cushion in one and two. Back straight away for the final time. Brad Sweet's going to have a shot at this. In the three and four to the checkered flag. It will be Jacob Allen ending the streak with Brad Sweet right behind him and Sheldon Hodgson getting third. He climbs out of the cockpit. Big smile there as the uh, head and neck safety restraint system comes off. NOS Energy Drink Victory Lane hat. VP Racing Fuels checkered flag. And he's up top to celebrate win number three of the year. Jacob Allen gets the job done at Cedar Lake Speedway. Yeah, that's good. Uh, that's what we work, you know, hard for. Uh, you know, I'm out here on the road. And, you know, it, it takes a toll on you when you're not winning and you're trying. and.
having bad results and stuff like that. So to get win three on the year is like so amazing. My dad put me up on a bet that he thought maybe I would win three and it kind of made me mad. I told him to go ride in the rig that day. So I got number three <laughs> and I can't thank uh, Mark Pell Tire Service, low E insulation for all they do to, um, on our car, triple X race cars, DMI, Newman engines. Um, Lucky, Tyler, and my dad, uh, you know, all the talking and focus and, you know, kind of, um, you know, having a bit of an attitude if things aren't going your way. Thank you for sticking through that and working hard with me. Um, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, for sure. Um, I wasn't, it's tough because I felt like I got through lap cars fairly decent and then I wasn't sure where to go on that restart. I mean, it's so thin on the bottom and then it's also so thin around the top in one and two. So. Um, I'm glad I decided to choose the lines that I did. It worked out in my favor. And uh, I'm just glad to have a, a good handling race car and good people behind me um, thinking, thinking right with me. And uh, I'm just very blessed and thankful to be, be in victory lane again. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I feel good. I, I think when your car feels, uh, you know, it, it's handling the way that you want it to handle. It's easy to maneuver the racetrack. And um, the package that we've uh, been able to, put together for these kind of racetracks seems to be working really well. So, um, yeah, it's awesome. It feels good to kind of hit on a setup and, and you just continue to make the right decisions from the time you roll out of the trailer into the very end of the night. So that's a very easy thing to say, but a very hard thing to do. And I, I'm glad that we're, we're able to do that. For live coverage of every World of Outlaws event and for extended on-demand race content, visit DirtVision.com. For full race results, features, and series news, visit worldofoutlaws.com.